Adam Dekanu makes a shocking confession after today's interrogation in detention. See details. Um, the confession of Mazen and the Kanu in detention is a positive one anyway. Um, is for actually for the good of the IPOPs and the Biafrans. You know, let me just give you a surface of it. Mazen the Kanu has made it open to the IPOPs that the fights he is fighting is the fight for the Republic of Biafra and not the fight for unity of Nigeria. In that very content, he said that he is ready to shed his last blood to see to the actualization of this very Republic. So therefore, the time the expense keeping him in detention, he said, is he, he targets as a waste of time and a waste of effort, because he on his own has already made up his mind. But the federal government are just deceiving themselves, thinking that he is going to change his mind. You understand, and that's just the hundred truth. So, my dear listeners, I tell you, it's a very shocking confession. You'll be amazed by hearing this very uh, perfection. You understand? And that is just the humble truth. All right, let's quickly look into the, co the, the, the contents and know what it actually meant. Mazi Namdekano, who we know as the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo, who has been in detention for months now, has spoken with surprises while speaking he called on his senior lawyer or Zekome, passing a message to the indigenous people of biafra he said that the fight of biafra is a fight for freedom and not unity of nigeria the ipops must know that we are formed for agitation for freedom and not for unity of Nigeria. He said, I have made up my mind to die for Biafra. Nigerian government are wasting their time keeping me long in detention because that alone can never change my mind. Long, long time ago, I've decided to sacrifice myself for Biafra. Now, is coming to pass. I may live, I may not live, but that is not what matters. What matters to me now is the Republic of Biafra. The situation of things I'd say is quite encouraging, but then I leave you with this piece of information to remain resolute to the struggle of Biafra as we all join in with victory at the last day. My dear, sometimes when I listen to a message from Unam De Kano to the IPOP members, I feel very, very weak inside. And after that, after that very weakness, I all of a sudden get back and feel energized again. That weakness is because of the pains that Namikano is going through in detention. And despite that, he's still, you know, moving on with the struggle and the agitation. He's still not giving up with the struggle. These people, they actually felt or think that Namikano will give up with the agitation, but I'm known to them that the guy is even getting stronger and stronger and stronger and stronger by the day. You see, what can be more interesting than what Namikano is doing right now? They have tried it many times, used people who are very close to him, used the, the king of his, of his, of his 
of this um, town now used the governor of his own village used top uh, uh, personality in UK and what have you yet he still stood on his ground and said no it is Biafra or nothing you see that they gave him reasonable positions reasonable offers yet it turned them down so do you think that such a person can easily change his mind they felt that when they subject him to serious torture that nobody will tell him to change his mind. Despite all of that, is Namdekano not still firm and strong? Let's tell ourselves the truth. This guy is the savior of the Southeast. Yes, a man of God said so. That Namdekano is the savior of the Southeast. The savior of the Southeast. That Southeast is a bit safe today. It is because of IPOP and Namdekano. I'm telling you, the testimony was given last year, Christmas, where the market women and the female farmers and male farmers were testifying, thanking the Eastern Security Network and Namdekano for the coming to their aid. They said that we celebrated our Christmas in peace. We went to our farm without anybody disturbing us. You know, we stayed in our farm. We, we harvested our crops. Nothing happened to us. All that thanks to the Eastern Security Network. You see? Hmm. There is fire on the mountain. There is fire on the mountain. All right. Um, let me hear you anyway, my dear listeners, on this very content to know what your own thoughts or opinion could be. All right. So please don't forget your comments still are very, very important. Don't forget to leave your comment below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.